think this one uh, might measure. It's going to be a little guy, but... This place, small ones, can make a difference. Let's see. Don't know if you'll get there though. First fish of the tournament, not a big one, but we'll take all the keepers we can. That was a moderate splash right there, but bluegill here are so big you never know that's a decent I think I'll measure we'll see oh well I think he was short we'll see they're stacked in back here though I think he was Probably another 12 incher. Not the kind of fish that's gonna win the tournament today though, so that's a better one. It's a little silly using the net for this guy, but it's not bad at all. Twelve and a half. Oop. There we go. Be a lot of those today. Another one. Out of this little area before I move the board. Kind of mornings I like for kayak fishing, just dead flat, calm, not hot. Can't get much better than that. All right, one more castle. Move up the way a little bit. I like this bank before shore fishermen get here. There's typically a lot of fish on it, despite it being the place you can cast from shore. Yeah. Oh, 
lets you down. This is tackle events, you only need three. Typically catch fish on the other side a little better, but wait till the sun comes up for over there because I like to sight fish them. It's already four fish, but only two keepers thus far. There's another one. I think he's going to be a short. Maybe not. Go measure. <clears throat> Skinny thing. Jeez, at least. <sighs> so then I thought he was the smallest one of the day, but <laughs> about the same size. It's the one thing about here that's it's nice if you're feeling bad about yourself you need to catch some fish come to La Suan but don't expect any of them to be worth much be oh. another 12 and a half Plastic worm is probably going to be the ticket. So, I'm wondering if switching to a bigger one will eliminate some of these small fry. I'm going to try a Texas rig for the first time. I think this is the place to learn how to use it, to be honest. Alright, this guy was bigger than I initially thought, so he is not a huge one, but first one over 13, for sure. Better than the other ones. Yeah, we'll see. Unbelievable. This is chunky, twelve and a half. I have an upgrade. Thank you. 
for sure that one's gonna be a, at least an inch upgrade. And same size as everything else we caught so far. I don't know. I don't have an upgrade by 9.30. I'll be going to the big lake. I think that's the best strategy. See, the problem I have with the, the larger lake here is that sometimes it's really hard to fish with the weeds. And earlier this year when I was here, I was not impressed. There's no, oh, came off. Felt pretty small though. Throw it right back, see if he comes for it. Oh, let me do that. All right, two more casts over here, and I'm going to run down the other side of the lake. Typically do better over there, but you never know. That's a decent one. Stay down. Stay down. I think just another fatter one. I don't think he's any bigger than any other ones we caught. Just probably. There we go. First halfway decent bass of the day, I think. Well, I was tricked earlier today. I think this guy's at least 13. That guy, ornery. Yeah. Got it at the touch, though. All that matters.
I can't get something little. More substantial than the spinner bait. There we go. That's a better fish. Yeah. Maybe a key is bigger lure, bigger bass. It's not very long, but it's bigger than the other ones today. Yeah, that's for sure. Ooh. They're 
13 and a half. Not too shabby. All right. Making progress. It's two 13s. There we go. that. Open half. Bye. Got a kicker. Maybe the sign to switch over to the spinner bit here. I feel like that eliminates some of the small ones. It's been the Get another upgrade. Camera was turned off, so it's alright. Almost 15 inches. Not too bad for a bass. Plus, man. <laughs> 